Today, lawmakers in the General Assembly are going to be voting on whether or not they're going to move up the deadline for mail-in ballots. This is something Republicans in other states have also pushed for since last year's general election. CBS 17's Joseph Holloway live at the legislative building ahead of today's vote. Joseph. Bill, Liz, voters would have to be even more careful about when they send off their ballot, of course, if this bill passes. Now, mail-in ballots would have to be into the county election board by 5 o'clock on election day. Now, of course, there's a, there are exceptions when it comes to military and overseas voters. Under the current law, as long as your mail-in ballot is postmarked by election day, it will still count as long as, as it makes it to the election office within three days. But the court, a court ruling, excuse me, last year extended that by six days. Democrats say that this proposal is another way to push former President Trump's movement to cast doubts about the last election. But Republicans say it's just about getting the results back quicker. Also, keep in mind, if this bill passes, Governor Cooper may veto it because he has been critical of proposals that could limit voting. That vote's going to happen during the morning Senate session, which starts at 9 30 right here at the legislative building. Live in Raleigh, Joseph Holloway, CBS 17 News.